Hi, my name is Rich Harrington, and I'm going to show you how to quickly enhance an environmental portrait inside of Luminar 4. This is the beta version, and it works as both a plugin or an application. To start, I'm going to balance out the exposure here for this environmental portrait using Accent AI. This is a nice, easy way to quickly enhance the image, and you see an overall improvement to the exposure and tone. We can also use AI structure here to add or subtract detail from the scene. So if I want a little bit softer of an image or a little bit more detail, which works well here on the dress and on the merry-go-round for a nice pop, but it doesn't add unwanted detail to the skin. That looks great. Let's go ahead and switch on over now to the portrait group and zoom in. I always suggest looking at 50% or even 100% so you can better judge what's happening with the skin. We'll start with AI Skin Enhancer and check the box here to evaluate the skin. This looks for any unwanted blemishes and in this case the skin's looking pretty good. You'll notice that it ignored the little moles here because those aren't really blemishes. Those are natural to the skin. But if you want, you can go to the Tools palette and easily remove those with a eraser tool. A gentle smoothing to the skin here is a nice overall change. Again, let's toggle the before and after and you see the improvement to the image. Now with Portrait Enhancer, there's a whole bunch of other stuff we can do. Eye Enhance brings out the sparkle in the eyes and we can pull out some of those shadows from the environment there just to get a nice even light. In fact, face light is going to target the face and allow you to relight the image, but just the face. It's like a reflector. That looks good. We'll whiten the eyes just to bring out the color a bit more and brighten up the smile ever so slightly with a little more saturation and redness there in the lips. You see it's very natural. I can choose the compare view here to see the before and after. And as I drag through, that's a nice overall improvement. Let's finish that out with just a little thickening of the eyebrows there. And open up the eyes ever so slightly because of the bright outdoor light that's causing her to squint. All right, that looks solid. We'll zoom back a little bit to evaluate the overall image itself. And I can see the before and after. The eyes look great, the smile looks great, and a lot of natural beauty with the environmental lighting really brought to life here, even though I shot with just the available light at the location.